Hello everyone, it's me ASM Arif welcoming you to my new tutorials and today I'll show you this type of movie poster design and better than this type of uh, movie poster design by the help of uh, the AI. After going to the prompt, I'll write down some prompt over there and then we'll back to the Photoshop and edit that photo according to the movie poster. So let's get started. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. Try another prompt here just writing over there thriller movie poster thriller movie poster Indian girl that's good and then aspect ratio we should change that will be ar and 3 by 4 writing another prompt indian girl in action pose thriller movie poster design okay and we should provide the aspect ratio that means the air copying this one and paste over there indian girl in action pose thriller movie poster or action let's try the action movie action movie poster design okay that's fine and those are the thriller movie poster you can use this photo uh, for like a thrilling type movie posters those are the trend and i'm just upscaling the first one that means uh, you for the upscale and i'm upscaling this one will work like that zoom out options they will provide me in a, a mid journey version 5.2 they given us the zoom out options so i applied over their zoom out options and they what they are providing me let's see so here our poster might be ready in this pose okay those are the nice options so that's fine one two three four one that means two i'll choose this one that means the upscale two and in this portion i'll take this one this is the proper thriller movie poster so after finishing the prompt generation i'll take this one i'll upscale the number two okay in the meantime i'm taking this one i'm opening up in this and save images save in this and the second one upscale the second one okay after upscaling that we'll work with these two poster and opening up into the browser here is the options if you open it up here is the open in browser options and it will open up in your browser and after that you can save this one and save that's good and already saved that I'm going to the Photoshop I'm going to the open options and from that I'm just opening one and opening two this one we'll work with these and these options that's fine and here this font and this font you can use any sort of fonts and everything so going to the text tool before that you have to reset these brush that means the foreground and background color D for reset and then going to the text tool and write over there so what should we write we write like um, like the girl okay that's fine and press ctrl or command t making this one a little bit of bigger that's fine i'll provide over there press ctrl or command t making this one more bigger no, we should change up the color 
go into these options and font as well so the girl we should use like a thriller type color or like this so this is good and okay what what about the white one or we can use the other color from here the red one okay if we use red we should use this one okay press control command t and making this one bigger and the curl so we can pick up color from here the girl so black that's good and after that that's fine in this portion we can do the clipping mask so going to the layer options control command j and then taking it upper side and create clipping mask press control command t and if we provide like that yeah that's fine and in this portion going to the blend options and adding some drop shadow that's good taking these two press ctrl or command t and the girl the girl or in this portion we can make change like that the girl okay or yeah that's the good idea but we have to make the drop shadow proper like this that's fine and now i'm going to the blend options and adding some stroke so stroke color should be red or white or taking from here actually white border and it should be inside and thickness will be only one that's good the curl and some bloody uh, like text over there that's good and from here i'm taking this text okay common v that's good it would be like white color making this one this white and placing to the downside or upper side is good and those things that means footer control command v control command t and placing over there changing the blend mode into normal that's good and middle of the artboard that's good and this text this photo it could be more bigger the girl into the middle of the artboard control command a middle of the artboard that's good control command d for the deselect and making this one a little bit of a smaller that's fine okay the downside that means this we have to place this one into the upper side of all layers and making this one a little bit smaller providing over there yeah our movie poster is ready now saving this one giving the name girl and saving this one into like jpeg version and save okay and in this this one um, taking the same text uh, only the text and this and this control command c control command v and in this portion will provide in this area
only this one should be closer the girl and in this portion i want to turn off the drop shadow and only stroke and turning off the fill color these type of things but in this case we have to increase the stroke thickness like five that's good and but i want to change the font type so going to the font options and changing the font like this control command t yeah or changing the num changing the name that's good that's fine in this case i want to provide here some blurry effect how to do that going to the layer option press ctrl or command j and taking this one upper side and right press and like create clipping mask press ctrl or command t little bit of di displacement okay that's fine in this portion i want to provide some fill color yeah press ctrl or command t so changing up okay in these that means this photo i want to go to make into the blur option going to the filter and going to the blur and then gaussian blur and changing it into the gaussian blur like this and now i can change up the position of this photo so some lighting area like yellowish light area yeah that's fine and saving this one another one and then saving into jpeg version and save it out so our movie poster is done so hope that you learned a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any sort of questions query please do comment on my video comment section until the next video i am signing out today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers and bye bye